A tailor has 30 yards of fabric. How many shirts can she complete if each shirt requires three and one quarter yards of fabric? All right, so the first part of this problem, what you want to change is that mixed number, that three and one quarter yard, um, into a fraction. Okay, so we're going to change that number into a fraction. And one method that I like using is the MAD method, okay, where the M stands for multiply, the A stands for add, and the D stands for denominator. All right, so what are we going to multiply? Well, we're going to multiply the whole number, the 3, by the denominator, the 4, okay? So that's step 1, the M of MAD. So 3 times 4 gives us 12. Then we're going to add. What are we going to add? We're going to add this number plus the numerator, plus the 1, okay? So 12 plus 1, 13. And then finally, the D of denominator just means that you're going to keep the same de denominator from the original mixed number. Okay, so in this case, you can see that the denominator is 4. All right, so 13 over 4 is the same as 3 and 1 fourth. Okay, so that was step 1. So for step 2, now we're going to find out um, how many shirts uh, that she can complete with uh, this amount of yards. Okay, so we're going to divide the number of yards by this fraction that we just um, created. Um, and remember that when you divide by a, num a whole number, like 30, if you make it into a fraction, it would be 30 divided over 1. And when you divide by a fraction, okay, in this case 13 by 4, you actually are multiplying by the reciprocal. Okay, so the reciprocal is basically when you take a fraction and you flip it um, on itself. Okay, so the 4 would become the numerator in the top. Okay, this, um, and then the 13 would become the denominator. Okay, so instead of dividing 30 over 1 divided by 13 over 4, we're going to multiply by the reciprocal, which is this flipped fraction. Okay, so 30 times 4, that gives us um, in the top 120 divided by 13, and that gives us 9 shirts.